Hello, and welcome back for our next episode of our Bioshock Infinite playthrough. Okay, Daisy Fitzroy is no longer. The world of Columbia is completely falling apart in disarray. I think we're getting closer to finding Comstock, even though we haven't really laid eyes on him much at all this entire game. And we are just about ready to go meet Mom, kinda, in a weird way, and get her to open up this door that we can't get into yet. I think we're gearing up for a big fight over there because we saw a lot of stuff over there that all has to do with helping you survive a fight. And I even think there's gonna be another the merge that takes place in this whole scenario, but only one way we're going to find out. If this is your first time finding the channel, welcome. Hope you have an awesome time, and if you do have a great time, sure hope you might even consider hitting that subscribe button for me. Without any further delay, let's get back into the craziness that has become Bioshock Infinite. Okay, the Bioshockathon continues. Oh, I was like, wait, I thought it was storming when, we, when I logged off. Okay, so it's still the same day. I don't know how much this I'm gonna play today, but I'm having a blast and I got the whole day to do it. So we're gonna continue. We got Elizabeth. She, I like her new look. It's a cool look. It still has the same theme, you know, the, the, the wardrobe, but she looks, I don't know if, I think angry would best describe it. I mean, like, look at her brows, like they're furrowed and she's like squinting her eyes and stuff. I'm just glad she's not mad at me anymore. But she's definitely not happy. She hasn't quite been the same ever since she did the thing she did with Fitzroy. So, uh, let's go say hi to mom. Yo, check this out over here. Whoa. It's like, I guess that's supposed to be a ri uh, maybe some more cloth that's waving in the sky over there. Man. This place is falling apart. Okay. Now, uh, I want to switch, nope, let's switch you out for this. There was a bunch of machines I didn't bother hacking before because I was trying to get to the save point and I, I actually just spent a bunch of money, so I figure we can take advantage of this now. It's like playing Vegas or something all of a sudden. It just starts raining the money. Nothing I need to buy though. Although I could probably buy some salt. Hey, there's a little bit. Okay, let's switch back over that before I accidentally use it. Uh, the cemetery. Let's look at the memorial garden. Maybe that's what, what it was. I don't know. I think we gotta go back this way. Yeah, here we go. Better check a few more of these bodies. I might get some more salt off of here. Okay, quick check on OBS. Looks like everything's working over there. Yeah, I'm absolutely loving this. I may not completely grasp what is going on. I think I kind of got an idea of it. But my my problem is, is it's like I keep thinking of things. It's like, okay, but if that's the case, then why this? If that's the case, then why is it? And I begin to overthink it. And part of me needs to realize it is just a game. And it's not like they tried to nail down every detail before they put this together so you know just enjoy it for what it is and work with what I know okay was there any more salt in here no nope, just again there's the graveyard Aha. hey I was going the right way I still can't get over how big and massive this area is it's huge where are you going come on here. what are we looking for well, we've already been over here once, Booker. You shouldn't be so confused, okay? Okay, is there anything I should open up that would, like, help me as soon as everything goes falling apart on us here? I see a bunch of, like, uh, guns and ammo and that sort of thing. I was hoping for, like, a turret or something. Anything floating in the sky? Nope, not quite yet. All right. Oh, look, it's like not part of this. Uh... Go ahead. That. Ah. <laughs> it's your mother's grave. They have her preserved in an airtight chamber. Fingerprints will get us into Comstock House. She's your mother. A mother who abandons their child doesn't draw a lot of sympathy in my book. Take a moment to think about what you're doing. There. Will you open the door or do I have to go in without you? <laughs> I, I thought it was going to give me a choice. I was going to be like, go on in. So, we're literally gonna drag this body over there? Is that what we're thinking? 
It's her. How are you, mother? All She's so mad. Long. Looks like you and I have some common ground. Let me do it. No. Let me do it. Ah, she's so mad. <laughs> so do I need to break it? Okay, open it. Booby trap. Oh, wow. You see, child. You chose to follow a false shepherd, and he has led you astray. What I do, I do for love. Elizabeth, are you all right? Where, where did she go? Hold on, you need to rest for me. No, I'm getting that hand. Elizabeth, I'm getting that. Hand. Why is your mother a ghost? She's not. He, he used me to, to power that device. He opened up some kind of tear. Oh, <laughs> this is just okay. This is really getting kind of weird now. I'm now hunting vampires. It feels like. Defeat the ghost of Comstock? Just regular guns? Uh, well, it's nice to know that blood still pops out of him. Uh. Oh! Did I get her? Oh my gosh! I don't know. What am I? My God, is she the source of my power? But what is she? Alive or dead? Why do you ask what? When the delicious question is when. The only difference between past and present is semantics. Lives, lived, will live. Dies, died, will die. If we could perceive time as it truly was. What reason would grammar professors have to get out of bed? Like us all. Lady Comstock exists across time. She is both alive and dead. She perceives being both. She finds this condition disagreeable. Uh, Perception right? without comprehension. It's a dangerous combination. Look! Footsteps. She goes to unfinished business. We have to follow her. Convince her to open the gate to Comstock House. This is so weird. <laughs> ah! Well, she was actually way easier than I expected. I had expected it to need to be something other than just bullets. <laughs> All right. We got that resolved very quickly, but we need that hand, as Elizabeth put it. Oh. It's a shame you have need of her to enter Comstock House. Frankly, she doesn't seem all that cooperative. There is a way to bring her to reason. Three truths you must discover first. Truths which, in this world, Comstock has destroyed. If only one of you had the power to alter time and space. That would be a blessing, wouldn't it? Hmm. <laughs> They're sarcastic. Find three tears. There's something off about Lady Comstock. Yeah. I notice. N no, you don't understand. She, she doesn't belong here. I brought something through. I'm just, I'm not so sure it was her. Ah. Okay, find three tears. Let's see if there's one here. I could see them doing some sneaky thing like that, like put one right in the place you came from. Because you wouldn't go back and check right away. Uh, oh, there's something shiny up there. Oh, yeah, that's a that gate I couldn't get into. I thought for sure we were going to merge. Oh, is there a lock on it now? There might be a lock on that we can maybe open. Okay. Well, let's go check that again real quick, because I think there's a, like, a shirt or pants or some kind of equipment in here. Yeah, it's over there. Can't get in yet. Okay. It was worth a quick gander. Wow, okay, so we are literally, like, dealing with time and space and all this kind of stuff. You know, it is funny, I, I could see why the storyline of this would seem so out of place compared to the other Bioshocks, because 
I think I was mistaken in the beginning. I believe the other Bioshocks take place after this one. So it's like if if we had abilities and we're learning about time and space and all that kind of stuff, why is there none of this going on in the next ones? Oh, look. I wonder if this is going to be a version of Elizabeth, maybe. I could see that being a thing. Okay, so one of the steps went this way. Uh, oh yeah, there they go. Okay. It's, uh, haven't hacked you yet. Give me that money. Freight hook. I don't think... I doubt she brought us all the way back here to get to a freight hook. Oh, boy. Ooh. Boom! Yeah. How'd you like that? Oh, Elizabeth. Walked right in front of that. Oh. You okay, girl? Oh, look at that. Steps go right into there. Okay. Get patched up here first. This is interesting. So Comstock has destroyed three truths, I think, that they said it was. And we're going to see if we can um, find what those truths are. That's the first interaction we've had with Comstock in a little while, too. Sweet. Need some help with this. No problem. Still can't get over how awesome this game is. Absolutely loving it. Yours. Even if it does slightly confuse me, it's still a blast. Oh, here's the here's their lab. Oh, we got blood vials just laying right there. Still can't get over how angry she looks at times. She is not happy. Some lock picks. Uh, like a that. Um, that's a big. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and grab it. Okay, nothing else I can see here. Sounds like a Tesla. Oh! Definitely something going on in there. Okay, we got an upstairs as well. We'll go here first. My goodness, look at the generator on this thing. Okay, so that's the tear. It's a tear. There's something in there. Should I open it? Yeah! Are you not going to give me the option? Oh, there we go. It's actually kind of hear, hard to hear some of what was being what said there. What did you there. mean before when you said Lady Comstock didn't belong here? She's almost feral. It's like she's a reflection. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, and then she think, oh no, we crashed. Okay, we're back. <laughs> what I was about to say is she said, I don't know, and then she just took off running. Okay, uh, what did we get here? Child of Science. Lady Comstock seems to believe the child is a result of some errant act of carnality between myself and her beloved prophet. Oh. I told the poor woman the truth, that the child was a product of our little contraption. But I think she found that less believable than her delusion. Okay, so Lutess, because that's what I was beginning to wonder at first. I was like, wait a minute, Lutess is the mother? Okay, so... Lady Comstock thought they had an affair, which created the child. And she's like, no, no. It's due to our experiment. And she's like, yeah, whatever. I know what kind of experiment you were trying. Okay, well, let's see what else we can find around this place. Oh, here we go. On the entropy of genes. Comstock seems to have been made sterile by simple exposure to our contraption. Oh. A theory. Just as sexual reproduction can de-emphasize the traits of each parent, so goes the effect of multiple realities on our own. Your traits dissipate, 
until they become unrecognizable or cease to exist. Oh. Traits. So goes the effect of multiple realities on our own. She talked about merging them? Have they been doing some of that already? Because I thought they were just kind of like jumping between them. Maybe that wasn't the case. I'm going to do my best to try to keep this straight. You guys let me know in the comments if I get really off track somewhere. You guys are really good about that. <laughs> Those are part of the experiment, huh? Okay. Wild. Oh, it's just some glowing orb. I got here. Only one obstacle. His office. Now that's the lighthouse we started at, because it's got this little dock and everything to it. Hmm. Okay, it's nice getting these little story bits here. Hopefully this is where things are going to really start to come together. Oh my goodness, they got generators going all the way up through here too. Wow, three of these bad boys. This thing requires some serious, serious power. I do like have a big old generator right here next to your bed. Oh, yes, I will take this. And we're going to go with... Man, we're getting close. Let's, let's focus and see if we can max out the health. It'd be cool to be able to get at least one of those maxed out. Okay, here. Nope. Man, that is serious though. Oh, we got one here. What'd you find? Oh, she must be pointing to that. Okay. Yep. Some money. Want it? Oh. Catch, Mr. DeWitt. She called me Mr. DeWitt. She's happy with me. A theory on our death. Okay, here we go. This should be good. Comstock has sabotaged our contraption. Yet, we are not dead. A theory. We are scattered amongst the possibility space. But my brother and I are together, and so I'm content. He is not. The business with the girl lies unresolved. But perhaps there is one who can finish it in our stead. Scattered amongst the possibility space. So they're scattered amongst all the different realities? Now, I want to, uh, you know, we haven't looked at this in a minute. I want to make sure I got the ones on here I want. I want everything. Okay, landing nearby. Yeah, I like that one. Uh, let's go back. Headmaster. Critical hit. I want to make sure one of these I accidentally switched. I want to make sure it's not one that I accidentally took off a crit damage or something. Hmm. And you provide ammo. Mm. Ooh, whoops. Nitro. Yeah, I think that's the one I had on there. Okay. And then this one here. Killing with devil shock jockey causes effect chain reaction. Hmm. I thought there was another one that had a crit damage thing, but but maybe this was the only one. Okay, we'll keep it on that. Okay, well, nothing I want to change there. So, they're scattered amongst the realities. Yeah, that... That doesn't make any sense at all. Not to me. That's where I really start getting confused. It's like, okay, what is... If we're merging the realities, what's up with them being in multiple different realities? You know, it's like, I, I just get confused. But I have been told by some of you, don't be too upset about that because I'm not the only one. That made me feel a little better. Okay. Freight hook. Oh, we got some footstep. Okay. I was about to say, I only saw two sets leaving that one space. I was a little nervous that I wouldn't know where else to go for the third one. Oh yeah, this lady. We're gonna pick up everything we can through here. There we are. Okay. Keep on going. Should be another group of bad guys coming up here soon. Hey, there we go. I can take the salt out of that now. 
this is so wild. Let's see if we can find all three tears and everything in this one episode. That would be awesome if we could. We're only about 20 minutes into it so far, so we're, we're looking good. I guess I'm going this way. Did I see that correctly? Is there another door over here that we can open? <coughs> I haven't seen any footprints here for a minute. Ah, there we go. That's what we want. Oh, where's she taking us? Oh, there's salt down there. We going up here, maybe? No mercy oh! <laughs> that caught me off guard. Oh, there's two of them. Where you at? Oh! Oh, yeah. Boom. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> that is serious. Where'd you go? Come here. Oh. Gotcha. Thank you. Ooh, how do you like that? <laughs> oh, oh, he blew up. I thought he was dead. All right, he did. There he goes. All right. Gotcha. Anybody else want to play? Huh? I didn't think so. That was chaos. Fun chaos. Ooh, hot dog and cotton candy in the trash. It's like a that's like a full meal right there. Ooh, man, look how quickly we got all our goodies back and all that good stuff. Okay, now they came out of this thing up here. Maybe we'll get lucky. I'm trying to remember were there for some reason I feel like there were hand cannon ammos up here. Maybe not. I want to check real quick just in case. Oop. Oh, that could be so disorienting sometimes. Okay, there's some ammo. It's not what I need to do. Volley. Okay, I guess not. Some salt here, though. Check over here. Oh! Look how good I am. I was like, wait a minute. I could have sworn there was maybe... I can't believe I actually remembered that correctly. I'm proud of myself. Okay, uh, let's head down here. Let's see if we can go in here now. I'm assuming this is where we're supposed to go. I didn't exactly see where the footprints went. What did this place have to do with my mother? Oh my gosh! What was that? What did she say? This is kind of freaky. Okay. Check it out, Elizabeth. Surely this won't be bad, right? Wow, we went into a whole new area. There's a freight hook. Wait a minute, have we been here? Is this where we started? Yep. Ah, uh, here, bad guys. Whoop. Ah! Uh. <laughs> uh. Need a grip. Right here. I'll take it. See ya. Okay, I know there was at least one more that way. Oh, there's more than just one over there. In fact, let's go ahead and switch it up a little bit. We got all this ammo. Yeah! <laughs> this gun is so much fun. Where'd you go? 
Gotcha. Gotcha. Nice try. Doing all right, Elizabeth? Oh, good shot, dude. Gotta get credit where credit's due, man. Look at that stud. One bolt in the chamber. All that paperwork. I like it. Okay, so maybe I have not been through here. Bank of the Prophet. Oh, you know, I don't think we did go into the Bank of the Prophet, did we? Okay, let's check both the upstairs first. Oh. A green light, I thought for sure that was going to be a place we could go into. Alright. I would like to make a withdrawal, please. That'll do. For starters. Cleaning house. Thank you very much. Found some money. Cash. <laughs> I was about to say, this is a really weird contraption. I didn't realize it's just a cash register on its side. I was like, what in the world? I wonder. What do you wonder? What are you thinking, Elizabeth? Speak your mind. Don't keep it to yourself. We gotta, we gotta talk this through, work this out. We're team. My good, could you imagine trying to keep this kind of a filing system in order? No, thank you. They don't have a ladder over here. Are you gonna get them the high ones? I don't think they're gonna do a very good job. I guess I can reload this now. There we go. Yeah, I changed it up there a little bit. I was like, you know what? Let's give the hand cannon a little bit of a break. It was fun. I love the sound of this gun. It's like, doom, 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 doom. It almost sounds like a rapid fire hand cannon, the way it shoots. Could you take a look at this lock? Only Keep one pick. Done. Easy peasy. 167 for one pick. Now that, that's a good deal. Wow. Their money's all over the place. Yeah, like they were keeping a good filing system. There's no way. They can't even keep all their money in the register. Okay, well, I think we cleared this out really well. Yo, check out that vault door. That's huge! Okay, did I already go... Okay, yep, looks like I've checked all that. 50%. What's that? 50% of everything people earn here goes right to Comstock as a tie. I gotta get me a job in the profit business. 50%? Does he not know the word tithe actually means 10? I think he, uh... I think he was taking advantage of these people a little bit. To go down to the vault. Okay, let's go this way then. I don't see it's over here. If that's the way we're supposed to go, I want to go the way we're not first. My goodness, this place is humongous. Well, I mean, if you're taking 50% of everything, I guess you gotta have a lot of space for it, right? Up to 18 picks. Anything over here? Any goodies? My, oh my, I didn't expect that door to open. Porter. Can't tell, is that an actual person right there? Wow, something went down in here. Look at that, you can pick up a money bag and then all the money that's built out. That's my kind of looting right there. Yo, I mean, I could be mistaken, but that looks a lot like Ryan. I can't be him, but it sure looks a lot like him, don't it? 21 picks. All right, what we got here? A new sure enemies become easier to melee execute. Oh, well, that's kind of cool, but no, I'm not going melee build on this. Uh, we'll take it though. You never know when I might need a new shirt because I get blood all over this one. Okay. All right. Well, let's see what's up here now. Oh yeah, it's a it's a person. He's just not a living person. Hmm. All right, let's see. Type three letters, 
to spell the voice. Three letters. V-O-X. Try the typewriter. Oh, I forgot we found that book forever ago. <laughs> yeah, baby. I'm so glad I went this way first. Burst gun. Okay. Another three bags of picks. I'm back up to 26. I will. Hold on. I got a system. All right, we're going to do this. We're going to max it out. Perfect. Wait. Did another dot just show up? I thought I was maxing it out, but I might not have. All right, let's check this out. Oh, this is from Lady Comstock. Okay. The Imagination of God. I know the prophet is a liar, but he cannot be. I know the prophet is a murderer, but he cannot be. Oh, no. For if the future lies only in the imagination of God, why would he reveal it to such a monster? Oh, wow. She was really not... I got a feeling the child was not the only thing that she was having issues with. How much you want to bet Comstock is the one that actually killed her off? Hmm. We might find out even the journal or the diary that she was using wasn't even her her diary. Okay. Well. We checked that out. I'm so glad we found that. All right, now we can follow this. That's huge. If I can go in there and loot all the coins in there. I found some money. Want it? I'm going to freak. I'm going to be like that. What was that cartoon back in the day with the duck that used to like swim through all the gold coins and stuff at the start of every episode? I can't even remember what it's called now, but... Okay, well, she took off this way. Ooh! Oh, he just disappeared. He wouldn't even let me shoot at him. Okay. Things gonna open? Nope. So why is there a crow that I can't shoot at? Kill your oppressor! Oh, I can now. Ooh! I was going to say, surely he's not the only one. Whoop! Sorry. Sniper. Where? Oh, is that what that little symbol there is? You. Sniper? Uh. Go ahead, stick your nose back out there. I'll snipe you with... Ah! <laughs> oh! I sniped him with my hand cannon from across the room. You guys saw it, right? It was a headshot too. It blew up and everything. That was beautiful. 28. I'm never going to run out of picks. No way. What'd you find? A splotch? Checking out a splotch. Does that look real interesting to you, Elizabeth? Okay. Well, I mean, I'm full on everything. It's funny, I'm almost reaching that point again where it's like, I don't know what the point of trying to find all this stuff is. I just like getting money. I'm glad there's not a money cap. If nothing else, it's still fine, fun to find money just because money? I can, just because I can keep adding in my wallet. I'm gonna be the richest booker in town. Okay, well that crow's gonna show up again at some point. Bank bag. You got ammo in your bank bag. I think you're collecting the wrong... wrong thing. Okay, nothing I can loot through there. There's a med kit that I don't need at the moment. Ooh, something went down there. Yeah, look at that. Look at that sniper. He couldn't keep it together. That's for sure. I wonder if he's like, uh, if he shoots me once. I wonder if I die or if, if I die real fast to those guys. 
I like the scarecrow. He just goes like zipping by the crow, the crow character. <laughs> Are you lost? You look like one of those little comic book cartoons where the person's zipping through one door to come out another door and then back through another door to pop out a different door they didn't go into, you know, all that kind of stuff. Huh. Trying to, um, get it all. I think there's a lockpick over there. You spotted that from there, huh? Yep, I'm at 30. Dropping a weapon creates a ghostly ally for a few seconds. Well, I rarely, rarely throw down a weapon. Since I like the two that I got so much. Here's some cash. Okay. Greg, you give me so much money. Oh. Oh, did you see her jump down there? That's kind of cool. Well, what else is in here? Yeah, I'm kind of thinking, let's look around first. This does not look stable or safe. Get it? It's a safe. <laughs> that was totally by accident, too. Here's the safe. Elizabeth? Hmm. Ooh, found a recording. Ready. What do we got? Mm. Alright, let's see what this is. No longer. Lotus says the bastard is a creation not of her womb, but of some unholy science. I do not know which is true. The child is no more divine than I. What says that from my husband's prophecy? He begs my silence, but I can only offer him forgiveness. But with repentance need come truth. I can suffer his lies no longer. Hmm. Clearly, there's definitely something more oh. to her death than what we've been told. I think we're about to find out what it is. Whether it has to do with this ghostly figure we're following around, I don't quite know yet, but... I think the way she died is going to turn out to be very different from uh, Miss Fitzroy. I'm beginning to think she probably had nothing to do with it. Okay. I don't need any loot, but I figured it was worth checking. Oh. Picked up some ammo. Okay. Let's see what's inside the next tier. Oh, are we fighting now? Are we? Ooh. Oh, yeah. Jump. You look like an executioner. I can help you with that. Remember to use your vigors. <laughs> I used my vigors a couple times. What are you talking about? And if I do this, this uh, sabotage, all their patents. All of them, Mr. Fink. Now, why does the prophet want these two killed? For the same reason Lady Comstock lies buried. Child. And why does he want me to do it? Because only you can make it seem an accident. I don't think that's the real Lady Comstock. I think she's... I think she's a combination of herself and my feelings towards her. What do you mean? I'm just so angry. At her and at my father. I think she's her, but she's also partly me. I'm not even sure I understand it myself. <laughs> okay. I'll throw this out there. I do not see how it could even possibly be possible. But what if... What if uh, Lady Comstock and Elizabeth turned out to be the same person? So, like, she was Lady Comstock first and then, you know, grew up and all this kind of stuff. And then through all these tears through space and everything, they grabbed a baby version of Lady Comstock from another another time. 
and she is the baby Elizabeth, and the reason she feels like she's a merge of the two is because as they're merging these different Columbias together, you're actually merging Elizabeth and Lady Comstock from these different realities because they're actually the same person. I mean, I really don't see how that could... I don't... I mean, I guess it could be a thing. See, that's the thing. When you start messing with time and space, it's like anything's possible. You, you could literally just come up with a reason or an explanation for any weird combination. I don't know. If that's the way this thing goes, I, I don't know how, but... Okay, let's see. We'll, we'll check this out. A broken circle. Oh, by Comstock. Okay. The Archangel tells me that Columbia will only survive so long as my line sits the throne. Yet Lady Comstock produces no child. I have done what a man can do, yet there is no child. I've asked Lutece about the matter, but even she refuses to help. Well, we know now that he's the reason they can't have a child, right? Because of all the merges through the realities. He's been made sterile, basically. If I'm understanding what was said earlier correctly. Why are the footsteps going back this way? Is there more? Oh. My goodness, this is freaky. Oh. Oh, right in the head. That's okay. I'm good. Yep. Boom. See you, chump. Oh, she's bringing more people in. Yeah. I uh, appreciate that. Oh, this one's already been hacked. Where'd she go? Where you at? There you are. Ooh. See you later, chump. Boom. Oh, boom. Gosh. <laughs> that was kind of nuts. Well, she was at least tougher that time. That felt more like a, a boss type fight. Okay. Yeah, dude, you had some cake. They brought you back from the dead and you had cake in your pocket. He was clearly living it up in heaven. Okay, well, let's see what's in here. Oh, is it just a shortcut? We got to go back out. Yeah, this was the stairway. We went that way. Okay, so she opened that big vault door. That's the one we passed by at the beginning. Okay, I kind of understand what's going on. Where are we at? 45 minutes? Mm, we're going to be pushing a little bit, but we will see. We'll see if we can get this last tear in the same episode. We got to go back up the Vader. This is wild. Oh, I thought that was Elizabeth for a second. I was like, what happened? There we go. Okay, so I assume we got one more encounter with her still. Those we've already looked at in red. Anybody else new out here? There's the footsteps. Okay. Okay, I think we're heading out all the way back to like where we first started doing all this backtracking. Because remember there was a split that went left and right? And I went right. So, I'm just going to sit here and start running and assume that other than the fact we might come across a few bad guys, I don't think we're really going to see anything new through here. We've basically combed through it twice at this point. Check it out, Elizabeth, man. She's just leading the way. I don't even have to wonder which way to go. Oop. Okay, she let me choose there. Thank you. Makes me feel important. All right, there's the footsteps. We should go through a little busted area here real soon where the guy's down there by the... Electricity. There we are. And now we're going to go this way. 
nope, not there. This way. Yeah, there's the footsteps I was expecting. But where... Oh, are we going to go into the big house now, maybe? That thing is freaky the way it talks each time. There's definitely going to be a big battle out here at some point, too. I mean, I guess it could be showing there was a big standoff. But I think it's going to be here for something I have to do. So can we get in here now? Nope. Okay, so that's not the way we're going yet. Must be something over here. Uh. Oh, you know what? We never even went down here, too. This will be my first time exploring this area. Victory Square. Vengeance is mine, saith the prophet. Oh! Got him as he was running by. Whoop. Oh, yeah. Thanks. I uh, appreciate it. Gotcha. Oh, can we tear something over there? Oh. I thought it was a turret. Gotcha. You ain't got four inches nothing. I'm just coming to you. I ain't even scared of you guys anymore. I just kind of run out to you. Boom. Gotcha. Boom. <laughs> How'd you like that? Oh. Okay. Oh, I thought you were dead already. <laughs> she yelled attack, hit me and got electrocuted. That was great. That'll do. Uh Oh, there's one. Now we got one shooting for us. Gotcha. Anybody else wanting some of this? Gotcha. It's so easy. I'm a one-man army. Well, I guess it's a two-man army, because between me and Elizabeth, I got anything and everything I could possibly want. You and me, girl. We are just making it right through this. All right. I think most of these bodies I even started searching like while I was still fighting, so there's probably not a whole lot to collect still. Hmm... My health is full, my ammo... I could use a little bit of hand cannon. You know what? Let's go hack these things and then I'll pick up that salt. That way we get our money back. Or our, our salt back, actually, I guess. Pro tip there, guys. Right there. Oh, that one filled me all the way up. I don't even gotta go to the other one. Oh, here we go. There's one more. Is that an armory one? Or one of these armory... That one is. Okay, we'll go hit that real quick, see if there's anything else to upgrade. There we are. I, I don't think there's going to be anything else opened up at this point, but you never know. We got volley, sniper, sniper. More sniper. <laughs> there's the burst gun. We did see one of those. Wow. One thing's for sure. If you tried to upgrade all the weapons, you could find yourself broke really fast. That's for sure. I got all this money and nothing really spend it on. I might as well use it for some things here, right? This thing adds explosive damage. Yeah. Totally doing that. Um... Let's go with... Hmm. It costs less. I just... I feel like the amount of machines I would need to cast this on to actually benefit from that would be... It'd be different if I felt like I was running out of salt all the time, but I, like, never run out of salt. So I, I'm not too worried about it. Devil's Kiss... Uh... Increase the stun duration. I'm not really using any of these. 
Mm. Okay, I'm gonna stick with what we got. I don't know, maybe there'll be something real fun to spend money on later and... Take it. I wish I had... I wish I had money to spend on it. Then again, it might just be a waste. Downtown! Oh! We're going into the photo center. Okay, let's go this way first. Harmony Lane! You guys just swing it, singing some sweet what tunes down here? How's the city going to come back from this? Right? Maybe it shouldn't. Oh my goodness. Yeah, no. It's uh It's falling apart for sure. Sniper, be careful. Where? Where's the sniper? Go ahead. All right. There's a decoy. Put it in your brain. Is that the sniper? He was a sniper. Uh, is that it? What are you swinging at? I don't know what he's swinging at over there. But I want to try out my new uh, explosive ram. Where you at, dude? Ah! There was another sniper. We're good. He got the jump on me, but we're fine. Yeah, I know you want me to go that way. But I want to see what's this way first. Look at that. It's just a, it's just a me booker. Just standing there. He's like, I ain't scared. He ain't gonna do nothing. Take a look at this lock. Ooh. Child's play. Well, you are the child. It's done. The joke works, right? Oh. Come here. Boom! That poor guy. That was that was overkill for sure. I thought there might be more. You know, I just I was just preparing for the worst. That's all. All right. Need money? Uh, always. Even if I don't, I do. If you know what I mean. Say no to money. Who would say no to money? Seems wrong. Landing off increases your speed. Yeah, I'll take it. But I'm not too worried about using it. About the only thing I might switch out for at this point is just something that does more damage. Because I just like all the damage. Okay, so there wasn't really... With the exception of just more loot we could find. Well, I guess we found that gear, too. Not really... Why is her feet going this way now? Hmm. Okay. I think that's as far as we need to go this way. I'm assuming that we can't actually get into this. Is this where we started? Have we, like, backtracked? Harmony Lane. Hmm. Okay. Cha-ching! <laughs> you say what you gotta hunt with that thing? A caterpillar? Dude, you should see everything I'm taking out with this. Reclaim for the people of Columbia. I'll take that. Okay. I'm beginning to think I'm really off course here. Oh wait, no, her feet are showing up again. I thought we needed to go into the photo place. The founders will bleed. Okay. I'm beginning to think that is where we need to go. But now I'm curious what's in the Photoshop. So... Oh, come on, make up your mind. There's supposed to be three tears. How are you pointing us in the four direction, huh? Are you just toying with me at this point? You need to make up your mind. I don't think I actually went into that building, did I? Okay, we might need to check that still. Alright, Photoshop should be like right up here. Photos taken here. Seems right up your alley. That won't take but a minute. That's kind of what I was banking on. 
done. Okay, well, there's a tear. Back in five minutes. Oh, I was like, man, photos ready in five minutes back here. In these days, that, that's impressive. Is there a book to pick up? Anything in here? Wow, there's a, a lot of camera stuff. A lot of pictures, but uh, not a whole lot to grab. Oh, shotgun. Okay, I was like, I was like, dang, look at that hand cannon. <laughs> I was like trying to upgrade me at this point with a new gun. I'll take it. But you two are dead. I took your funeral photo. Yes, and made an absolute hash of it. One doesn't expect a picture of one's corpse. It's come across so lifelessly. <laughs> Okay. The customer's late. That's insanity. What proof would you have that Mr. Fink would hurt the Lutesses? The Lutesses told me. The Lutesses? When? Yesterday. <laughs> Yesterday morning. Rupert! They've been dead these seven days. <laughs> Who told you they were dead? They did. That's a line you don't hear too often, is it? Okay, her feet's going that way. Okay, well now we're gonna go to that gate, and we're gonna see what leads back that way because I'm I'm really curious. We are definitely about that hour mark. This lady can't decide unless the paths like converge on the same place, but I don't think they do. His gate is not this direction unless there's. Oh, I guess there could be two ways to get to that gate. See her feet show up again. Uh, you take a look at this lock. Beggar's Alley. Okay, it is another path to get. Okay, okay, that makes me feel better. At least I kind of understand what's going on now. So, we've gotten all three tears now. Did this open up? You know what? We are like at that one hour mark. Will it me use this elevator? Okay, let's use this. Okay. I did that just to kind of get a save right here so that I actually end this right about the one hour mark. So, still kind of confused on who Lady Comstock actually is. It doesn't sound like she's... Well, we know she's not the actual mother of Elizabeth. That actually looks kind of cool. Um, oh, you know what? That flashing light might really bug people. So, the Lutesses were working with Comstock, or at least the sister was. The brother somehow got stuck on another reality and she said something about Comstock had like sabotaged the equipment. So I guess that means it like blew up, shattered or whatever. I mean, it did look like it was all destroyed inside the lab, even though it was still functioning. Um, and she talked about being scattered across all the realities. So I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, maybe we, uh, maybe there's actually like a, let's just say a hundred Columbia's and we're in the process of actually bringing them all back together. So there is only one. There's not supposed to be multiple. I don't know if that's an option or not, but uh, we're going to continue to unsolve this mystery as we continue in the next episode until next time, continue to be safe out there. Oh, and let me know in the comments, what's your theory about what's going on here? If you just don't already know because you've finished the game anyways, until then be safe out there. I'll see you on the next one. <laughs>